What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. So, let's continue on with the adventure for now. Um, and right before I started, I saw a NPC walking around, and I don't know where she went, but we're gonna run around town. There, nope. Is that it? Yes, that's her. So, what's her name? Oh, God. Just ran right into her. Oh, I know you. You took up steel and drove the dragon from Cassidus, yes? I heard about that. And of course you know me. I come here now and again to restock my wares. Uh, you do recall me, yes? Madeline, finest peddler in all Grancis? Ravishing beauty of legend and song? Madam, well, no matter. These are dark days, so terrible. And yet, come on, let's get to your quest. Fortune, let's get to your quest. <laughs> Only a fool. You will be my. And with that, we must. I trust you know of the encampment outside the village. I must travel there with all speed. Would you see? Alright, so we gotta escort Madeline. I don't remember much, but I remember that Madeline's quest, if you get through all of it, you get some. Like, she, I, I wanna say she sells, like, really rare, badass items. What do you want, Gwyneth? I have no advice to give. It is but a short walk, but we mustn't grow complacent. We're gonna get her over there, we'll kill the goblins and stuff. Then we're coming back and we're doing bitter black. That's one of the interesting things about this game. There's a lot of like timed quests, basically, we like things that you could completely miss travel. if you're not traveling around the world. This looks like bait. It's a chest leading up top on a hill. Shit, where's Madeline at? Don't worry, that goblin's not gonna come near you. My party will handle it. Come this way. Come on. craziest thing is how I was talking about the world's longest test request. This is not it. This one is, this is chill. This is like a nice, I just got to get her down the street a little bit. The real escort request is coming up. It's the hardest part of the game. You just got to get through it. And then an entire world of content opens up to you. Oh my God. She's like picking up dimes on the street. Madeline, I swear to God. There's a fine treat. You leave me with no choice, woman. This is what we're doing. You're nope. Stop fussing. Stop it. Come on. We're going over here. There we go. We've made it to the camp. Success. And all thanks goes to your fine work. We'd best be inside, don't you? I love that that actually worked. This may sound untoward, but have you aught in the way of coin? Please, I must make for the capital, but times are dark and my purse light. It's a terrible curse being poor. Will you spare some gold? I would- I am so very much in love with you at this moment. A woman's heart is a dangerous creature, but you know well how to take it. Oft has it been said, a poor life is a happy one. Never found this to be true. If ever fortune sees you to Grand Sorith and me to setting up my shop, you must come. You'll find not but the finest wares. Okay, she has the parafats, um, which are basically like consumables that make you really strong. They're temporary, but uh, for a while, people would you'd pop these when fighting like final bosses and stuff. Um, what else do you got? Throat cutters. Get 
would be good. Do I wanna? No, I'll wait till I'm at the capital. Um. Baleful nails. Yes, I will buy those. Actually, you know what? I will. Um, strength, magic, defenses. Just give this to me. I will take the baleful nails. Thank you. Um, and I am going to give her a tunic, maybe. buy two tunics and I would like um she gains more defense piercing resist and debilitation one of these as well please and so that oh god no she already had it I didn't know she had one already well that's unfortunate and she has this already. Damn it! Wasting my money. I got lots of money though. It'll be good. Um, and then you don't have. Oh, I don't think you have lanterns at all. I gotta find somebody that sells lanterns. I've learned what to do in this quest. All right, and maybe that was what I had to do because I don't see the indicator for. Bitter black anymore on my map. It might be because yep, it's because I was inside the fort. So you'll notice our health um, is slightly below max. Health is interesting in Dragon's Dogma. The idea is that every time you take damage, you lose a small amount of health that you won't get back until you've rested. So the idea is like, as you go on an adventure, if you keep getting hit and hit and hit. You either need to like rest or eat to get your health back up to max but there is also a small amount of health that is healable so think of it like you know scrapes and bruises that are gonna heal back up as you continue your adventure but obviously you know if you got stabbed in the arm it's gonna take a while for that to heal so it's both cases where there's there's temp damage and there's permanent damage which i've always found pretty interesting anyway let's show you one of the dopest dlcs that's ever been created now we're not going to be doing much with this place right now, uh, simply because I'm pretty sure I couldn't even kill anything this early. I mean, I might be able to, but probably not. I want to say Bitter Black is scaled for you to be a much later level, and I don't think I can actually do anything yet. I think I need to need to make it nighttime first. This does look really good on PC, though. Like compared to how dated Skyrim was feeling. Like, there's obviously a little bit of this that, that feels dated, but between the updated jumping and higher FPS and all that, this is feeling really good. Rest till night. So I notice after resting, my health will go. The uh, part that I had lost, that'll go back up. Now it's checking in on my pawn, basically. Let's see if anybody's rented my pawn. If they have, I'll get some rewards out of it. Seems Nobody has. Frequented by peddlers and the like. I've learned of this area. Seems a fair place to rest. Knowledge chair. We should do some of that. I am 
were ever aware of the enemy's weakness in battle, be they alone or in numbers. That's good. Understood. My first I trust we will see many victories together. How shall I celebrate our triumphs? Understood. So what is her inclination right now? Um Challenger Utilarian. That is perfect. That's like exactly what I want for her. Because Challenger means she's going to try and take down big stuff with her bow. Utilarian means she's going to survey the battlefield and think about what she could do to assist the team. That is great. Because there's things you can give your pawn to like forcefully change their inclination. Um, in theory, I could go Challenger Mitigator, but Challenger Utilarian is really good. Alright, so this is just a sad waifu. We're going to talk to her. Not even risking that cutscene getting hit. Gotta go up higher. You, you can see me. Then you are one known to the dragon. Die in need of you have my eternal thank. You speak now to a shadow of soul. I would take you there. There we go. I had to tab out. I didn't have my OBS up. Were it possible, I would not send you off with so meager an explanation. But I fear I myself do not know it better. My past, my aims in coming here, all of it is lost, as in a fog. All I know is that I, like you, was called here, and am bound to stay. I sensed you in the distance, and called to you for help. I knew somehow, as by instinct, that you could grant the wish of the one who dwells below. Just as I know my role here is to aid you in that pursuit. Alright, so these are all bitter black quests. Find the Arisen Wandering the Labyrinth, purify a cursed item, further upgrade a weapon that has been strengthened in Wormfire. We're not going to be able to do any of these, but we'll pick them up. Lock a new cape. And we're not going in there. There's the pawn stone. I thought there was a couple more loot, like hidden around the island. Picking up some stuff. Alright, yeah, that's like a shortcut door I think I get later. This place is basically like a giant dungeon. Filled with goodies and monsters and all kinds of powerful loot. Completely outclasses anything you could get. Um, the base game too. Shortcut. Shall we rest before pressing on? I am versed in the pure. Should you, in your travels, find such ensorcelled objects, pray. The procedure requires but a few rift crystals. I shall aid you however I can, for therein lies my own path forward. I shall aid you however I can, sir. Alright, well we have it unlocked now. So having that off the map will be be useful, but um I could have find an old road can guide you to Bitter Black. Uh more than likely we're not gonna end up doing that for quite a while. Bitter Black is really good, but to be honest with y'all, it's probably like 50 episodes away. So, more magic defense. I think that's lightning defense and sleep. I lose one physical resist. Let's go for it. And then give this to Valkyrie. There you go. You got a cloak now. All right, and with that, let's make our way out of here. We're going to continue up to the bridge and um, 
Yeah, we'll keep going. I'll just spend my, my XP when I get to the uh, get to the capital. But so the the game plan is I'm gonna try and make it up to the escort quest. I need to find merchants at the town. I gotta buy them lanterns. As you can, I mean, the pawns, when you rent a pawn, they come with the gear that they had on, but you can still give them gear, which will make them, um, like if I wanted, if I didn't want that one in that mage robe or whatever, I could give her something else and she would wear it. Who, who are you trying to fight? Oh, oops. God, I love that double jump thing. I mean, it's not like a traditional double jump, but basically I'm able to jump like twice the height I normally would. Like, typically, you'd barely be able to, to jump up and grab that. I am Mercedes. I've heard talk of the Arisen. I've ordered pawns to take up swords and fight myself. But they are a clumsy lot. I cannot call them into this world as you do, though. What manner of... Well, it matters not. The dragon is come. I'll welcome any help. Make use of the encampment as you please. Are you in need of rest? Well, come again whenever you... T I want to say that when we talk to her, that triggers the whole, uh... whole quest. But... We can see. Uh, let's see. Flesh skewer is pretty cool. I lift objects or grapple hold. I want the one that lets you climb onto people. Um you know what, let's get some let's get some abilities here so I'm not just using the same sword thing over and over again. What will it be today? Have your pick, any you like. What will it be today? Full bend. Um, yes. I'm going to save up and get her some stuff. So three fold is good. Wedge could be good. Let's do full bend instead of cloud burst because she probably can't use cloud burst that effectively. And then I think there's some merchants that I can interact with in this camp. Maybe not. Where do Mercedes go? She is. Let's just talk to her and we'll get this underway. As you will. Close enough to the head. There we 
Here we go. It's one head down. Strange rune again. I am impressed. Oh, oh be damned! Is your handiwork? For true? Oh, what did the lack of an idol doing here anyway? Ancient tales of the Arisen are well and good, friend. But make a gift of this head to the Duke. And you might earn yourself a real title. Arisen. I see better now from whence the legends arose. Good judgment, swift footwork. Impressive, truly. In any case, the Duke will want to know of this attack. I'd hoped to gather a larger force before leaving for the capital. But a Hydra's head and the Arisen who claimed it make up the difference amply. I cannot say what the past may hold. You will need your strength. It will be slow going with a cart. I dare say you will have no trouble catching up. We'll meet at the way castle. Till then, I bid you rest well. It is a long road ahead. I feel more familiar with this quest. And what was that thing? It was like you come to an impasse on a quest. I think it was telling me like I need to do certain things or consider I'm abandoned. I, with I couldn't really see what it said. Because this is the new new main quest. Um, but I know certain quests will get that they'll essentially be like, oh, you know, you should have finished it when you could, and they'll disable. Not sure which. It went too fast for me to see. Um, all right, you know what? Let's let's wrap up here because up next we gotta that's the escort mission. We essentially gotta stay with this cart and escort this head a long way. I want to try and catch what it said there um, before it like skip to the second part of dialogue. But either way, we'll figure it out. So stay tuned. I will have more Dragon's Dogma coming your way soon, and I will see you guys all then.